Okay, Roger, congratulations. But first of all, I just want to ask, uh, how's that pizza tasting this year? <laughs> it's good. I didn't actually have a piece yet. I still have to get uh, one slice before it's all gone. But uh, no, look, the ball boys were happy. Uh, uh, I used to be one of them and, uh, you know, I love seeing them happy. And uh, it's gotten a bit of a tradition, you know, that I give the ball boys a bit of pizza at, at the end of the tournament, regardless if I win or lose. Um, but recently it's been successful here in Basel and then they get really excited to see me up close and person like this and it was, it was really nice. Yeah, I mean, you're now a five, five-time champion. Um, you were just far too good for Nishikori today, weren't you? I think, I think it went well for me today. I mean, it was tricky playing someone I've never played before in, a, in such a big match for me, really, here back in Basel. And he had nothing to lose. He just came off the great win against Burdich and other players and also then Djokovic, obviously, yesterday. And I knew that he has the game because I've practiced with him before. He's got enough power, he's got enough speed. And he'll be one of the you know the great talents you know to look for in the next few years, and that's why I'm very happy that the way I was able to play today, uh, from start to finish, uh, it was my the best match of the tournament so far, and obviously in the finals to save best for last is is, is great. Yeah, and obviously great for you to get back in the winner's circle. Um, you looked quite emotional as well, which normally used to seeing you crying uh, when you lose rather than when you win. Well, the thing is, here in Basel during the ceremony, it reminds me so much of when I used to uh, be a ball boy myself here. The, the trophy ceremony is still very much the same. The ball boys are right in the front row, standing close to you. The music's still the same. And it just reminds me of how lucky I am that I am actually able to play on this court in front of all these people, giving me a standing ovation. And this is then when it kind of all starts happening, you know, that I get emotional. So it just shows how much it means to me to still play tennis and at the highest of levels. and. Sure, the, the win couldn't come at a better moment. I've just taken six weeks off, and it kind of gives me reason that it was the right thing to do. And I still have some big tournaments left. Paris, I've never won before. Uh, London, I've, uh, or the World Tour Finals, I've been able to win it five times, and I'm defending champion there as well. So obviously, I'm, I'm eager to do well at both events. Yeah.